Hey, what's happening, everybody? Welcome back to the Titanium Kingdom, where we open card games and all sorts of other fun stuff. And today is the day that I've been waiting for for a long time, because I've really wanted to open this game, and that is the Wild Storms Expandable Superhero Collectible Card Game. The reason I've been waiting for this for such a long time is because I love comics, I love superheroes, and I love card games. And this is one card game that I've been following and researching about for some time now, and I've really wanted to open this for you guys on this channel. So I finally got two starter decks, and I'm going to open them up and see what's inside. Now there was some uh, expansions for this game when it was published back in like the mid 90s sometime. Let's see if we can find a date on here, 1995. Um, there was a couple expansions for this card game and you can still find sealed products obviously online, but they are ridiculously expensive if you wanna get like a booster box. So for that reason, I just spent like the 50 bucks uh, 25 a piece on these little guys and so they're not cheap so that I could open them up on here and so that I could have a couple of these decks laying around to probably play with because um, I love early image comics probably some of my favorite comics books still today and so you know Wild Storms was was Jim Lee's kind of branch off from Image Comics before he sold it to DC in the late 90s. And so let's bust this open and see what we got inside. <clears throat> and from all that I could find, this card game is very similar to the Versus Systems, or at least played similarly to the Versus Systems card game that came out years later um, that I remember when I was in high school and college, which I loved and I have a huge collection of. Um, I never got into playing it too much, obviously, because I didn't really, you know, have too many people to play with. But... Uh, I love the game, and apparently, at least the names of the cards, or the, the types of cards, are very similar. So I, I'm wondering if they actually based that card game upon this one, because this was like the first early kind of collectible card game with superheroes. So let's open this up. No particular smell. Already, I just love the art. So here you get a little rule booklet. It's gonna teach you how to play. And let's see what kind of characters we got. Hmm. <laughs> it's Fairchild. Coda Warrior. Nice. Already I'm going to say I love the way that this this kind of is designed right here. It's very unique. Um, and the artwork is obviously just amazing. Although that doesn't really look like a shotgun. That looks like some sort of space blaster. <laughs> I recognize Mr. Lynch. Pretty sure that's who that is.
Mm. Grifter. No, it seems like it's all repeating now. CUDA training. Heck yeah. Pilgrim. Craze Retreat. Two. Nice. Machine pistol. Winter. And this is a little card that kind of shows you how to play and how to set up. I like that. Very cool. I'm I'm really impressed with this card game. Already. Now let's see. We get anything different in this one now because they're in there really snug it makes it really kind of difficult to get this open and I don't want to damage the box obviously I'm kind of surprised the cards inside are not and a plastic. No new cards? No. Of course it's, you know, 25 years old. It's not in a plastic wrap. So I assume it's not going to have a smell. some upside down cards here. Bulletproof vest. Jam. Blitz. Black razor. Jam. Dud. Dodge. Pact of honor. The Golden Gate Bridge. <laughs> Emergency Medic. Dozer. Heck yeah. Synergy. Bullet Bike. Nice. And Dane. So that's it, guys. That is two decks from the Wildstorms Expandable Superhero Collectible card game. As you can see, you know, each, each deck has something different. Different hero cards, a little bit different equipment, and, and the other card types. So no two packs are the same, which is pretty awesome. Um, 
and really only a characteristic of older card games. Nowadays, you buy a you buy a deck, and you guys have seen open, me open plenty of starter decks before. Basically, it has the card list right on the back, which I kind of like about this because it kind of gives you a randomization of cards in here. So it's it's sort of like a booster pack and a and a starter deck all in one. I definitely want to collect more of these cards. However, like I said, the price point of these are is is pretty high. So I don't know if I'll end up getting any more of these cards in the foreseeable future unless I come into insane amounts of money that which I can just throw around. But uh, I'm definitely going to have a lot of fun learning this game and playing this game with my wife. Hopefully she has as much fun with it as I will. So uh, let me know in the comments down below what you would rate this game. What you think about the art, obviously I love the art in this game, and that's a huge turn on for me uh, as far as getting into a game initially. Uh, it's gotta have some, some cool art to kind of hook me in and make me want to play the game. It also has really uh, awesome theme. The, the comic book thing is just amazing, especially in the Wildstorms un universe. Um, and as far as the gameplay and everything else, I'm not sure, but, uh, I am familiar with other, uh, superhero collectible card games, such as the Versus system. And so, um, I liked those. Hopefully it's a little bit like that. Um, and yeah, until next time, guys, uh, I'll talk to you later. Bye.